What's going on guys? So in this video, we're gonna talk about the five simple steps to being happy. A lot of my clients struggle with just finding that true inner happiness. So I thought I'd break it down to five easy steps so that you can become more happy. Let's just dive straight into it because maybe you're somebody who's struggling with this and you're not wanting to sit around and wait and find out what they are. So let's just dump straight into it. Number one, stop trying to please everybody. This is probably one of the biggest traits that I see with a number of my clients who are like fixer rescuers or people pleasers or however you might want to look at it. They are the personal traits that put other people before you. This is one of the biggest downsides when it comes to actually being happy because other people are not going to respect you in the way that you desire to be respected so ultimately they're going to use you they're going to take advantage of you and that's going to leave you feeling resentful and frustrated and just unhappy which is the opposite of what it is that we're wanting to achieve here so first and foremost stop trying to please everybody second stop trying to get everybody to like you now this one is probably going to trigger some of the internal conversation of being like oh but what if they don't like me all of this sort of thing you know then who am I? Then what am I going to do? All of that. But relax, breathe. I can assure you that when you actually stop caring about trying to get other people to like you, you are going to find that you are going to open up a new space within your, in yourself that is going to aid in creating a deeper sense of happiness with inside. And the thing is, is when you actually try and get people to like you, you're actually doing a lot more detriment to yourself because people like somebody who is like them. So in order for you to have other people to like you, you need to be like them. So you're not being you, you're not being true to yourself, you're being true to who they are. And that is just gonna create a massive disconnect with inside of your heart, inside of your soul. And in here, it's going to be just screaming that you're not being true to yourself. So stop trying to get people to like you and stop trying to be like them. All right, number three, stop caring about what other people think. So probably one of the most challenging aspects in here as well is going to be stopping to care what other people think. Now, when it comes to this, we can be so caught up on what other people say about us or you know, if we do something, then what are they gonna react? They're gonna judge me, all of this. But I can assure you that when you stop caring about what other people think about you, you start to get free freedom, not just happiness, but you start to get a freedom with inside of you that allows you to be more of who you are. So how to stop caring what other people think? It's a case of understanding that everybody is on their own personal journey. We are all in a different space and a different point in time. And at the same point, they are only operating from what their perception is, what their belief is. It actually has nothing to do with you, but everything to do with the other person because something that you say, okay, they might react, but they're not reacting because you said it. They're reacting because what you said triggered something in with inside them and that's where they're speaking from. So it actually has nothing to do with you. It has everything to do with their own personal growth and their own journey. Number four, start connecting with who you are. Start understanding who are you? What are your hobbies? What are your interests? What are the things you love? What do you want to do? Like what lights you up? And also understand your values because when you start to understand who you are now that we've gone through everything about stopping pleasing people stop caring about what they think stop trying to get people to like you when you start to connect in with yourself and understand your own value set understand your own desires your enjoyments everything like this get clear on you one of the best ways to be able to do this is to get your own space isolate yourself for a week or two be in your own space and actually just allow whatever it is to come up because when you actually give yourself the chance to be quiet quiet in here, quiet in here, you'll actually start to understand who you are as an individual. All right, lastly, number five, put down that social media, put down that phone, put down that technology, and go and do something physical. Get outside, go for a walk, go and put your feet in the grass, go and go to the gym, go do yoga, go do something that fuels your soul and not something that burns your brain out or has you in a space where you're constantly questioning or judging yourself or comparing yourself to other people like social media has, scrolling through Instagram, scrolling through Facebook, seeing other people's lives, and you're only seeing their highlight reels. So step number five is to put down the phone, leave it. It's going to probably create a little bit of anxiety with inside of you, but just be with it. It is okay. I can assure you, you will be fine. Go for a walk around the block, do something short, just do something so that you can start to have that deeper connection within yourself. Because I can assure you, if you follow the five simple steps that I just outlined, stop pleasing everybody, stop trying to get everybody to like you, stop caring what other people think, connect in with who you are, understand your values and what lights you up, and go and do something away from social media, I can assure you 
you that if you go and do those five steps, and these steps can just take a couple of minutes, they don't have to take long. But once you've gone through those and had that process as a unconscious reaction, now moving forward, I can assure you, you'll get more happiness with inside of you. So like always, if you got any value out of this one, like it, share it, comment it, show it some love, and check out the details in the description. See you on the next one. Cheers.